Matt, just the early threes from Sasha and how that kind of set the tone for, for what happened tonight. It was awesome. <laughs> 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 it just set the tone for us, man. It's just like, about a third one, just Matt, you just erupted. And that's, it's tough to overcome that if you're the, if you're the opposing team and you hear that kind of noise after a three. And he was, I mean, he was getting us going with, en with his energy all night uh, in those first, I think he had the first nine points. The game for us is just awesome to see a play. If you see a guy step up like that when you start. It's also a, a, a confidence boost. I mean, not just for Saj, but you know, our whole team. You know, uh, we've been struggling to shoot as of lately. Um, and you know, when Saj gets it going, and then other people get it going, it makes the game a lot fun. It makes it easier. So um, I, I want to thank Saj for that one. <laughs> uh, Jihad, you mentioned that nights like tonight is why you came to Purdue and everything and obviously you were part of the team last year. How much did it mean to just get going with this crowd and the history of uh, the meeting they had in March? Um, well, even though I wasn't here last year, um, I'm here now. So whatever pain they felt last year, I'm going to feel the same pain they do. Uh, whatever revenge they want, I want the same revenge. I mean, we're still a team. Um, I, I didn't personally, like I said, I didn't personally feel it last year, but I watched it. Um, they were recruiting me at the time, so um, I mean, you know, this team went through a lot last year, especially being that close to beating them. Um, so, you know, I'm just as eager to play them again and, beat, and do what we did on our home, on home court. Um, you know, I hope we match up again. Same situation, so <laughs> we get the same outcome. Just for Sasha, just what were you trying to get done there early? I think last year probably you probably got the spiel about run up and down the floor a few times, getting a rhythm. Mm -hmm. When you're making your first college start against that opponent in this environment, what are you trying to do early on there? Um, I was just trying to be aggressive. I think the past, um, the, uh, last week in the tournament in Florida, I thought I played pretty poorly. I wasn't really aggressive. I wasn't really ready. Um, so tonight I just wanted to come out and be aggressive, uh, do anything that I could to help try to win. And, um, you know, that happened to be shooting. And, get some steals and everything like that. So I just wanted to come out and have a lot of energy to get it, get us going. Was that in part because of just your, making your first start or just the game itself? I mean, yeah, obviously a little bit of both. I, I think um, anytime you have what, they were fifth, right? Anytime you have the fifth ranked opponent in your home court, I think you got to bring the energy. With, with a crowd like that, sold out, insanely loud, I think you kind of pick up off of that energy as well. So I think it was just, it was just a, a great night, and um, we got it done. Since uh, Jahad brought up the prospect of revenge, basically the idea of revenge, and did, did once now that you guys have actually played this game, I mean, does it feel like revenge, or does it feel like you guys play just a different, a totally different basketball team? Um, personally, for me, like I, I wasn't looking at it as revenge at all. Mm -hmm. I think, um, I think it's a totally different team. I think we're a totally different team. I think it was just more they're a terrific team this year. So I think. Um, that last year it happened, you know, um, there's nothing you can do about it now. I think it was just, we just came in and we just wanted to, to fight them and kind of just do um, what we do best, and I think we did it. Matt, can you? Um, I think Sash said it really well. Uh, for me, it was about, you know, testing ourselves against a top five team in the country. Um, you know, you can talk about last year all you want. Uh, now it was about this game, it was about tonight. Um, you know, we had some guys that weren't there last year. You know, of course, a bunch of guys that were, but um, totally different teams. So I think it was just really about just testing ourselves and showing people that we, you know, we have what it takes to be a really good team. Question for uh, Matt: uh, the chemistry with Travion, how did you feel it was tonight? How do you think that's going to continue to develop over time? Uh, I felt I felt really good. You know, even though we uh, we're not extremely experienced playing together, um, you know, we're we're good friends on and off the court. So you know, it really you know we enjoyed playing together. Uh, I think we're pretty good at giving each other the ball. Um, I probably threw the ball into the post the most tonight. Uh, <laughs> so, you know, I just, I think we have good chemistry that way, you know. Um, so I'm, I'm always really excited to get on the floor with him because I know he's a really good passer. I know he's a great post player. Um, so it's always really fun. You know, I think we have a really, a lot of fun. You know, I think that's something that can't be understated. Uh, how important it is, you know, to have, to have fun with it as well. And that's, I think we did that tonight. Because how important was it to to get a victory against a team like this tonight after having had three losses in November and, uh, and taking on someone like this that uh, kind of sets a statement that people see around the country? Uh, I mean, this is a great win for us, you know, but it, it can't end here right now. You know, this is the start of something. Um, you know, we we got to show now. we got to turn the corner and we got to show that we've learned from those losses. Um, you know, tonight is a great start, but um, if that doesn't continue, then this is meaningless. You know, like we've got to continue 
playing well. We're going to continue guarding well, uh, guarding people. If we do that, you know, this is going to be a great statement win for us. Um, you know, like we did last year where we started to turn around. I think this can be the start of that and show that we've learned of our losses. Matt, we talked a lot in the offseason about how this might be a season where you look for the three a little bit more. How has your standard kind of changed in terms of when to shoot, when not to shoot relative to kind of last year? Uh, if I'm open, I shoot it. <laughs> Coach Kane tells me if I'm open, I shoot it. Jihad's pretty experienced. But if you're open, shoot it. Or else Coach Kane yells at me. Um, so if you're open, shoot it. You know, he said uh, about tonight, you know, if they give you a good shot, you better take it because they're probably not going to give you a second good shot. Uh, I think we did a great job just team wide capitalizing on the good shots we, we did get uh, and just capitalize on those right away. You know, we weren't. If we got a good shot, we weren't trying to, like, oh, let's try to get this like extra great shot because that extra great shot wasn't coming. We got to. You know, we got to take those good shots, and I think we did that all night. And that's what I thought, you know. The late clock, the second one late clock, it might have been semi-contested. I was like, we're probably not getting anything better. Just throw it up. <laughs> uh, Tasha, Jaha, just to play directly off of that, I know that was something that Matt said, and I think Jaha, you said, I know Eric said, was just you guys were looking for the first available shot. I mean, it, do you come into a game like this knowing jump shots are going to be there and not necessarily hunting them, but just going into every possession, just looking for the first look you get? Um, I just think that goes with any game. Uh, I think our team has had that uh, kind of relaxed mindset on the offensive end where we've been, uh, I wouldn't say robotic, but we have been playing the play and not playing the game of basketball. Um, you know, I get coach, you know, my club player or something, but I felt like today we took our opportunities when we felt like we had a, had a chance. And, you know, that's what he wants us to do. Um, just because the play is called, he doesn't necessarily want us to run it all the way through every time. Um, and I felt like we were stuck doing that a lot of times, you know, catching ourselves late in the shot clock, you know, not having nowhere to go, not knowing who to pass to, um, things like that. And I, today we just played, um, you know, we we had a game plan and he told us, you know, you probably won't get a, another open shot, you know, because they are a tremendous defensive team. Um, but I think that just has to carry over into the next game, you know. When we have our chances, you got to take them. Uh, everybody on this team is good enough to make shots, create a shot. So you just got to be confident in yourself. Um, and I think today was a good boost for that. Yeah, going off that, like what I what I talked about earlier, just being aggressive. I think if you're able to get that first opportunity, like you said, we could all make plays and everything. And Coach Banner instills a lot of confidence in us to make those plays. So I think if we're open. He always said, like they said, to shoot it, get get yours. That's what I'm so Oscar, when did you find out you would? You would be starting tonight. Um, earlier in the week, I was with like the starting group, so um, whenever that was, that was Monday, I think it was. Um, just kind of figured it out, and from there, today it was confirmed. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> didn't even know for sure. Yeah, I didn't know for sure. Is that a good thing <coughs> to really know until today? Um, until today? Yeah, I mean, regardless, even if I'm not starting, I think I, I try to bring the same energy off the bench. And, doesn't really matter if I play 10 minutes, 30 minutes, whatever. Um, I think I'll just try to bring that same energy every time. Cast everyone else's reaction to you hitting three straight. What was your reaction? And I saw there was a celebration in the locker room. Yeah, yeah, it's really cool to, <laughs> to have everybody. I knew it was coming. I, I walked into the locker room, and they're all huddled around the, the water cooler, like getting cups ready and stuff. But and we're going to throw the whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, no, it's really cool. It's really cool. I've kind of dreamed of these moments, and, you know, Playing in front of that crowd in Mackey, um, like I said, I dreamed of that moment before. So um, it was just a cool, it was an unbelievable night. And happy to do it with my teammates. Thank you guys. Thank you.